It's important to remember that all models, linear or otherwise, come with limitations that they're only going to actually work for a certain range of input values. So for example, a 4-year-old boy is currently 39 inches tall, and you're told to expect him to grow 2 and a half inches a year. And so we might write a, an explicit linear equation saying, well, my current or initial, po um, uh, population, or in this case height, is 39 inches tall and we're expecting that to increase by 2 and a half inches per year, so this is my common difference. So we're expecting it to increase by 2 and a half inches per year for each year, uh, where n here is years after, uh, I guess after now or after 4 year old, after 4 years old. So years after 4 years old. So then we can make predictions. At age 6, for example, uh, this would be how many years after 4 years old? This would be 2 years later, right? And so we could figure out p sub 2. p sub 2 is going to be 39 plus 2.5 times 2. 2.5 times 2 is 5. Add that on and we get 44 inches tall, which is probably very reasonable uh, for a prediction. Now, on the other hand, if we tried to continue this model out, then age 50 would be, what, 46 years after he's, uh, 4 years old. And if we tried to make a prediction there, 39 plus 2.5 times 46 equals, uh, 154 inches, uh, which in case if you're curious is about, is about 12.8 feet. Uh, that is pretty darn tall, and so this is probably unreasonable. Unreasonable. And the reason that this is unreasonable isn't because our model was a bad model, it's just that our model is only valid for a certain amount of time. Uh, in this case, if we're talking about a child's growth, at some point a child stops growing, and so even if the height starts out increasing fairly linearly, at some point, it's going to level off, and chances are it's going to even stop altogether, and the child's going to remain essentially the same height the rest of their life. And so this is an example of model breakdown, and it's something we always need to consider whenever we're making predictions based on a model we've created.